League on EA Sports. And today's Clash of Conferences is just moments away. It's the Lions and the Raiders coming up next. Jalen Richard going to take it out of his end zone. And ultimately cannot get this out to the 25-yard line as he's dropped at the 23. The Raiders set to go to work behind their veteran quarterback, and that's Derek Carr. It's been fun to watch his development through the years, and right now what you see is a very confident quarterback who has a strong sense of self, totally understands the offense, and knows how to get the ball to his playmakers on the run. Four yards the result on the first play from scrimmage. Second down. First carry for Josh Jacobs. And he'll get about four across the 30 to the 32. Typically, we think it's the strong safeties that are better tacklers, especially closer to the line of scrimmage amidst traffic. But in this case, how about the free safety coming up and making the big time play? Now the throw on third down, knocked away and incomplete. On fourth down, A.J. Cole comes on to punt. And look here, it's an opening drive fake. And this is caught, and the fake will work. He's going to have a first down. Wow, what a gutsy call. If you're the defense, opening drive, you just got the stop, or at least you think, and then boom, right back on the field for more. It had the feel of something that they had planned for all week long. Hey, first drive of the game, let's be aggressive, let's go get them. And now defensively, they've got to be writing notes to themselves. In practice, work on big punts right out of the game because that was really unexpected. So the ball moves into Lion territory now. Here's first and 10 at the 42-yard line. And this one almost intercepted. Not a good throw there. Nearly an opening drive, INT. Now Carr, after the incomplete pass, brings him up second and 10. Meanwhile, Carr's throw there complete to Ruggs. And he gets it down a yard or two shy of the 30 before he's out of bounds. Nine yards, and that leaves him just short, so it'll be third and less than a yard. Got his connection complete to Ruggs. And he is going to have the Raiders first down, and he'll have it by plenty as they're able to keep the drive alive on third and inches. That throw's not going to get them a whole lot, but that really didn't matter, did it? They got what they needed on that throw. Picked up the first down, and I'm going cliche here. Game of inches, partner. Absolutely. We, and you talk to me a lot about opening drives, how key those are to set the tone. You kept the drive alive. Third down conversion here's been. Car to throw again. Going for it all. And oh, that would get a wide up incomplete. Nearly an interception in the end zone. Probably should have been. Third down coming up. Letting one go deep for the end zone. Toward the back corner of the end zone, but he could not get the feet down. This will wind up incomplete. So Carr exits on fourth down, and on comes Daniel Carlson for the field goal try. And he'll try and throw here on the fake. And it's complete. They're going to get the first. The fake field goal catches everyone by surprise. And the Raiders drive right down the field and score on the opening drive. CD, that call, it took some guts. It's not like they were at the one-yard line. They had some distance to go. They certainly did. And, you know, a lot of people might say that's fly by the seat of your pants type of coaching. But it's also sending a message out there. We're going to be unpredictable. You can't prepare for anything with us. Oh, and now they're going to fake it. He's got it at the 10. And he is not going to make it. They stop him up short, and this will remain a 6-0 ball game. I thought the days of the fake extra point were numbered once they moved these kicks back to the 15. Apparently, I was mistaken. Yeah, I was wondering who was ever going to try to do this. In fact, I quit wondering. I didn't think it would ever happen. Taking a fake from the 15-yard line to try and pick up an extra point, I didn't think anyone would ever call this. Boy, so they don't get the conversion, but they're going to go right into the onside kick formation. And this one travels out of bounds, so unsuccessful there on the onside kick try. And that drives coaches insane, doesn't it? When they see that happen, it just, it just doesn't feel right, does it? Plus, you're giving up yardage. On 
first and ten. Gone. His throw incomplete. Nowadays, quarterbacks don't mind throwing in the coverage because of the confidence they have in their receivers to come down with the ball. But sometimes you have to be careful you don't get too confident and throw an interception. Here's second and ten. Now gone. This ball tipped, and it's going to be incomplete. Fortunate, maybe, to get that back. It's third down. Throwing on third. Golf. Toward the sideline. Did he keep the feet in? Yes, he got them both down, says the side judge. And that's good enough for a first down. Plenty of things to talk about here, partner, but to me, their defense gave up a touchdown on the first drive. How about how they're responding, coming back? That's a big third down pickup to keep their drive alive. Again, golf. It's another pass to Pyramid, and it's complete. And out of bounds right around the 20. A good pickup there, eight yards on the first down completion. And brought down, but not before they get it inside the 10 to the 7. You think about the strong safety position, and you know, they're the more bulkier guys in the free safety, but that time, great athleticism to hustle in and break up that play. Now it's gone. He rifles one that's intercepted. Jonathan Abram picks it. He's at the 50. He's at the 30, 10, and he takes this one back into the end zone, and the Raider defense delivers a score. We thought this defense would be opportunistic, and they were. 